What's going on guys and welcome back to another Overwatch live commentary. Now I've had a lot of people asking me why I've done pretty much every single hero in a live com video except for Farah because I am a soldier main. Ooh, piece of candy. I am a soldier main in TF2 which means that, you know, logically Farah should come pretty naturally to me. Funnily enough, I have kind of struggled with her a little bit when I've been uh, trying to learn her a bit more in Overwatch but either way today we're going to jump in, we're going to give her a go, we're going to try and not get killed by the Bastion that I just saw sneaking off to the side and with any luck we can get ourselves a pretty good win right here today but first things first we're gonna be to jump up see if we can spot out that Bastion and spam him from a distance kind of Farah versus Bastion is an interesting one Farah is great at taking out Bastions when she knows where they are but uh if he manages to uh kind of get the jump on us we could be in a little bit of trouble holy crap we die fast Okay, that is exactly what we're going to have to watch out for because, well, we can uh, do quite a bit by getting the jump on him from uh, funny angles. The truth of the matter is, if he manages to sneak up on us or, you know, even just get a nice big volley off when we midair, we will die in like half a second. Although my real question is, can we kill that Roadhog? He's so low. Oh, come on, team. Yeah, just defend it. He's so low. I'm going to get him. Okay, Roadhog's down. We can do this. I'm not going to use my ult. I'm going to save it. Reinhardt's down. That Lucio is not going to escape either. Okay. We're getting back in the saddle. <laughs> that was a nice little play we had there. I think we took out three on the point. Holy shit, he was in a fucking bush. I heard him, but I couldn't see him. This is going to be like a really great face-off. I feel like we, you know, ideally we should win more fights against Bastion than we lose if we play it intelligently and we actually know where he's hiding. The only thing we're going to have to watch out for is something like that. I kind of want to use my ult on him, but I don't know. There we go. No! Oh, God, no. Wake me up. Wake me up inside. Thank you very much. Where are the bad guys? Here we go. That's the Ryan. He's so hurt. No, they're healing him up too. Okay, we're going to have to probably back up a little bit here. Get ourselves some health. And then we'll go back in. Did we manage to hold? We did, I think. Maybe. I think we managed to hold. Okay. Now I'm going to get revenge on that Bastion. Sh oh, there he is! No! <laughs> Not this time, you prick. You can see he's he's actually he's playing this really smart. He's repositioning. I don't know who the hell I just killed there. He's repositioning every single time that I jump up because he knows that I'm going to be looking in that spot the next time. So you can see now he's all the way back there. So we are going to have to be very, very careful about what kind of angles we peek now. An enemy looks like... Where is he? Where is he? I can hear him. I can hear him. Where is he gone? I'm so scared right now. I've died. I've let him get the jump on me one too many times. And it's embarrassing each time it happens. I'm determined for that to not happen again. Oh my... I had to say it. I had to fucking... Good God! Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is really, really bad. There are going to be so many people roasting me in the comments for just being, like, a general idiot. But, oh, man, I am so pissed at this Bastion right now. We're just going to spam some shots there. Get a bit of ultimate charge with any luck. And then we're probably going to have to try and take up our position on the roof here. That's going to be the best spot for us to try and hold off Bastion. we got my ult coming up as well, so if we can sneak behind them... Oh, no. This is really not good. You're going to have to stay on me, Mercy. Burn the Reinhardt shield, guys. Because if they get that Bastion set up behind the Reinhardt shield, we're going to have a world of hurt to deal with. And I can see him right there. Come on. No, no, no. Don't reload now. Oh, God. Okay, I screwed that one up. Mercy. Oh, my God. Okay. We need to deal with Bastion now. This Mercy is doing everything she can to keep me alive. But they're also doing a pretty good job of keeping that Bastion alive, so... I don't know exactly what we should do here. I'm tempted to just, like, solo ult him. we got to deal with him, Mercy. You and me. Where's he gone? Oh, he's ulting. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Oh, both their supports. And the soldier. I can't get him. How am I missing? Okay, there we go. Thank God. That was close. Did they just res? Oh, no, that was us. Oh, I was going to say, I didn't think they had a Mercy. Punch him. Oh. That's how you take out a Reinhardt, everybody. Where's that Bastion? I can hear him. 
The number one thing I'm thankful for is that Bastions make a hell of a lot of noise. Okay, how are we doing? We got gold A limbs. Silver damage. And we I want I want all the golds though. It's not enough. Oh Jesus, yeah, get up here, Mercy. Just if you got res? No, it's down. Okay, this soldier is probably gonna try and come up here. There we go. Soldier's dead. Man! Fire can deal so much damage with a direct hit rocket. It's kind of scary. Let's get him. Die! Another punch! Holy crap, man. Wait. I don't even fucking use my gun. It's unbelievable. Okay, they got two minutes left. We've stalled them pretty well here. I'd say we're looking good. We're looking pretty good right now. I can see that soldier right there. And we don't have mercy with us anymore, so we probably want to back up. I gotta give massive props to the supports on this team because I'm just they they they're doing a great job of keeping me alive considering how like stupid aggressively I'm playing right now. Like I am just like having these massive one-on-one -on -one fights with the enemy team. And we're somehow not dying through them, which is get off my roof. It's my roof. We're somehow not dying through them, which is a pretty good testament to the supports on this team. Okay, I think we're gonna have to also go. For that mercy, if I can find her. Although that Genji, get off my mercy. She's mine. Oh, I know the diva was like, thank you. Not that she needed saving because she was on full health, but I like to pretend she did. You know what we could do actually, if they don't spot me here, we could do something like. Oh, they've got a widow now. Oh, this was not good. That was so not good. And this. It's called one of those times when Muzalk's an idiot. Okay, but it looks like their Bastion got a bit tired of me just shooting him over and over again. He's gone Widow now, which is quite a good counter to Afara because she's basically vulnerable to any kind of hit scan hero that can just pick her out of the sky. You can still play Farah totally fine though when there's good hit scan on the other team. You just need to be playing a bit more safely and holy mother of god I would kill for a heal right now. Thank you. Okay. Now where is... Oh there she is. There she is. I don't know where she put that poison trap. Okay. Okay. Come on Widow. I will get revenge on you. For murdering my family. Oh, Genji, I've told you about this before. Off the Widowmaker. I mean, I mean, off the Mercy. I don't know what the heroes are called in this game. Oh, we're gonna get shot in like one second. Widow! Get down from there. Oh, she's so hurt. She's so hurt! No! Oh my god, no. We can't. We can't win while I'm dead. Are we gonna win? They're not touching the cart! Oh my god. Another victory for the Muzalk Farah. Actually, well, that's the first victory, really. So I guess that's just the first victory. But I think we're going to do one more round because with a play of the game and a pretty fun game all round, I'd say I'm, I'm in the mood to do one more. And oh, that was nice. We are really lucky that soldier didn't turn around there. He, uh, I don't know what his reaction times were, but they weren't the best. Oh my god, okay, we're getting thrown right in here. <laughs> okay, guys, well, I've ended up joining up to a new server here, and as I pick my hero, it looks like we are immediately going out of the gate with three Silver Portrait people on the other team. Now, it's not that Silver Portrait equals skill, but I am a little bit terrified right now, although we are getting some seriously nice spam damage happening right off the bat here. Although I think we're going to have to back up a bit, and maybe we can get a shot on that Tracer as she's coming through that door. Oh, she's going to be flanking around the back, and we... We're going to be coming up to this rooftop here to see if we can pick off the Hanzo. And it looks like we can. Can we get the second Shimada, brother? Oh, he's just hiding inside right now. I do want to kill that Diva, though. She's going to go down as well. And I think we're going to get a nice easy cap on the point here. I'm not saying that that was, you know, totally us. But I feel like that, that massive spam we got right as they were all pushing forward was a, a really, really nice thing to give our team the advantage when it came to capping that point. And I think we're just going to keep doing that. Diva's probably going to evaporate it, but then, uh, you know, it's a bit less of her ability she'll have when they actually reach the point. Okay, now let's jump up here. I don't even know who I killed. See if we can get the Ana. She's down too. Maybe the Roadhog along with it. That's a two for one deal. And can we finish off the Mercy as well? And the Diva! There we go. My god. Shimada brother, get back here. And that's a Genji too. Man, this is, this is going pretty well right now. Although... As I expected, they've decided to whip out the Widowmaker, which uh, 
This is going to be a nasty little counter to my Fara gameplay. So we might see if we can just sneak around here. And, oh, there she is. There she is. And I think we're just going to ditch. Let's go over here. Can we get a shot off on the enemy, though? We dropped the beat. There, Lucio's dead. There. Oh, no. Their diva is not quite dead yet. And I think we going to have to see if we can find that Widow. Oh, there she is. And she's down as well. My god. This is an absolutely awesome game. Getting the hog. Anybody else? Oh, uh, what's that? Arna, you want to die too? Oh, please don't tell me I got overly cocky here. No. Nope. Okay, we're fine. I feel like they just, there were just more people. Every time I turn around, more people. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we do not have the heals here. I'm just going to make a quick retreat. <laughs> Grab that health kit. And then we'll get back onto the point. I don't think they even managed to cap there, though. So we are looking pretty damn good right now. I do want that Genji, though. I really want that Genji. And with 90%, we can probably just get ourselves killed right here. Pop the ulti. And get a nice, easy first round on this map. I'm so sorry, Zenyata. This is the end for you, my friend. Are they on the point? Anyone that I can use my ulti on? How about you, Genji? Let's do it on you. That looks like fun! <laughs> no! Oh, well, I wanted to use it before the end of the round anyway. Please don't tell me I just threw the game. Are we going to win? We're going to win, right, guys? I wasn't a total idiot. No, okay, we got it. We're fine. Everything's going okay. We got 16 kills in that first round. I feel like the enemy, though, they're catching on to the fact that, you know, we're kind of slaughtering everyone. So, uh, they might have a couple of counters for us in this next one. Now, as soon as they start bringing out a few more hit scan heroes, which I really think they will, they'll probably have 76, maybe even that Widow Maker. Are you joking? That's, that's, that's Muzok's basketball life in a nutshell. My god. I reckon they'll probably have a 76, maybe McCree, a Widow. They've definitely got that Zenyatta. So, this should be a bit of a tougher round for us. Probably, hopefully, which means we're just gonna have to play a bit more intelligently. Which is something that I'm, you know, as most of you know, I'm really not good at doing the whole playing intelligently thing. I'm more of a kind of, you know, just run in and scream wildly type guy. But let's, uh, we'll put some spam off here, see if we can get through that diva shield. And then I think it might be time for us to fly over the top. Let's see what we can do here. So I can see that Zenyatta, who's just getting some spam ready to go. And we are gonna pick him off. Okay, that's a nice way to start the round. But I got that 76, like I predicted. Who we are going to have to kill as well, if we can get through that shield. And I think we're going to get another win here on the first round. Okay. Are we going to cap, guys? I mean, that's my definite preference. Oh, no. Where is she? That mech is so low. I think it's going to stay up, though. Okay, there we go. Nice cap on the first point there. We're going to keep on spamming at Zenyatta. Can we get a nice pickoff? Come on! The answer to that question is no. Although, if he decides to come through that door there... So I really hope he does. Then we could get a pretty funny knock off the side of a cliff. That's the great thing about Farah on a map like this. The amount of kind of cliff knocks you can do is amazing. And so much fun at the same time. Okay, that's a lot. That's a... You really hurt me there. I'm slowly getting the feeling that the enemy team doesn't really like me. Are they going to be waiting in here? Okay, they're not. Thank God. Oh, there's one. Okay, I'm out of here. I'll see you lads in the next one. In the meantime, I think we might just slide our way down this hill. Grab ourselves a little bit of health. And then pop back outside here. I'm just going to try and be a bit of a pain in the enemy's backside. As long as we're back here. And they keep like looking around with paranoid faces. Then we're kind of helping my team out indirectly. Okay. Oh god, that's a 76 ult. Let's get out there, boys. Oh no. I don't want to die to a Zenyatta. I don't want to die to a Zenyatta. No. So now they do have the Zenyatta, the McCree, and the 76, as well as a Diva, which are all really, really good ways to stop a Farah because the Diva can absorb all that spam I'm putting out. 76 and McCree can just fire me out of the air in like half a second, and they can do it even quicker when they've got a Zenyatta popping his ulti from the top. Come on! No! Ah. Uh. That was a really aggressive ult. I don't think that was ever going to work, but I felt like I needed to do something, man. I was panicking. Basically, right now, whenever we press Q to pop our ultimate, it's just a death sentence. They have so much hit scan, we can barely do anything. 
Okay, I feel like our big hope here is hopefully this team is going to be able to just like kind of get up in the enemy's faces enough to really kind of uh, distract them so they can't just go for me. And oh my god, if that had missed again, I would have taken that as a sign. A sign from Kaplan that I should just never play basketball ever again. Go in. Here we go. Get in there. No, that's not going to happen. Okay, here we go. We can get some really good spam off again on this first point. So, uh, Messi, just damage boost me when I jump. We'll get some, we'll get some nice early spam. Which will be, is always, always good fun. Okay, you can see me putting it all through that door. And I think the diva evaporated most of it. But we can still do this right here. Which should actually just either make the diva waste her defense matrix. And at the very least, kind of help my team get some of that early damage. Which we really, really need. Okay, we gotta start playing a bit intelligently here as opposed to like where we're positioning ourselves. So as you can tell, that McCree is really wanting to take me out right now. Like he is only going for me. Along with a few of his other friends. Okay, let's see if we can just keep spamming that. Every single time I poke my head out, that McCree is just all over it. Can we get him? Yes, we can. Okay. Thank you very much, Mercy. Let's see if we can just get back in here. Maybe get that 76. Our big chance is going to be if we can stagger the enemy team. If we can stagger them, get them running in one by one, and not have to deal with everyone at the same time, I feel like that's our best chance. And a lot of the time, you know, people aren't... They're not really smart enough to group up again very well once you actually start separating them apart from each other. So if we can just keep getting that spam, maybe pick off a hero or two, I think we'll be fine. But once again, man... My supports right now are MVP. And oh, we got a bit of damage on the Mercy, but it's not enough. I'm just going to position myself here. I'm going to try and wait for that Discord Orb to go away. And then, oh, we got the 70. Oh, that wasn't 76. That was a McCree. Just as good. 76 or McCree. I'm always going to be happy when either one of them dies. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not good. Give me that shield, baby. Okay, I'm out of here. I don't know if we're going to be able to hold this, but I'm definitely going to come back in here. Go, 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 no! They made me blow myself up. Who's going to win this fight? Oh, this is going to be close. I think we can do this, though. We got 70% on the point. This next kill in the kill feed? Oh, no. Okay. Oh, no, she rezzed! Man, this Mercy is doing amazingly right now. Oh, I don't want to get picked off by a high noon. Thank you very much. Are we good here? Okay, that McCree stopped shooting. At 76, he's down. No. Oh. Everything is okay. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team with good supports. And I think this could be it for us right here. Can we do it? 99% and we've done it. Easy wins. Easy life, man. That got a little bit hairy in the second round. I didn't I didn't have a ton of confidence, but we managed to pull it off in the end. I don't think we got anything play of the game worthy, though. And there you go. It's going to go to the enemy diva, probably with a nice ultimate coming out from her. But, guys, thanks for watching the video. If there are any heroes I'm yet to try... Oh, the old chimney strat. If there, are any if there are any heroes that I haven't tried yet or any heroes that you want me to play again, please tell me down in the comments section below. But as always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you legends in the next one. Bye-bye.